you know, that show put me on the map. It was a remarkable experience. I mean, I didn't know anything about that kind of writing. Uh, you know, the intricate plotting of, of Columbo um, that Bill and Dick were masters at, just masters at. Uh, you know, and they plot these damn things out and say, okay, here, go write it. Okay, you know, and then I'd, I'd write a script and then they'd rewrite it. <laughs> and the first one I ever wrote uh, called Murder by the Book it was directed by Steven Spielberg. Uh, who was a kid at Universal at the time, as was I. And, and you know, we were, we were great pals. We'd go to lunch at Arts Deli every day and, you know, talk about what we were doing and what we wanted to do. And, and he was doing this Columbo. And, I mean, we just had a great time. Uh, and that episode got nominated for an Emmy. In the first year of Columbo, I think there were... There were only three writing nominations in the writing category, and all of them were Columbo's. And and one of them was mine. I say mine, you know. It, Bill and Dick, of course, had, had their thumbprints all over every word of it. Um, they, one of theirs that they had written, and and one written by a guy named Jackson Gillis, who was an old mystery writer and a terrific guy. And Dick Levinson schmucked me. He kept saying to me, oh, you're going to win this because yours is the best one. Yours is the best. You're going to win it. There's no question you're going to win it. You're going to win it. It's the best one. And actually, I think it was the best one. Uh, it just happened to have my name on it, you know. But, oh, you're going to win it. You're going to win it. So, I, I mean, this is 1971. So, I, I went out and I bought a tuxedo. It was blue denim. So 1971, this is really blue denim with, you know, blue velvet lapels. Oh, Christ. So, and of course they won. They won, as they should, because it was their show. They created it, and so no one was going to give, you know, some little pitcher like me an Emmy. And I was devastated. <laughs> I just thought, you know, that son of a bitch, he conned me into thinking I was going to win it. 